Over 42,000 in attendance for Dan Lanning's first ever spring game at Autzen Stadium, and it did not disappoint. Lots of fireworks on both sides of the ball as the yellow team got the 31-21 victory over the green team. And let's start with Bo Nix, the transfer from Auburn, got the party started early with the touchdown pass to Seven McGee. Yeah, he came out firing. I was impressed with Nix. This is a very nice throw here on the money, down the field, on a line. Great throw ball. Nix finished with three touchdowns, one interception, was 8 of 15, and was able to connect with Thornton on two long touchdowns. And as Coach mentioned, the touch on the deep ball was something that really stood out with Bo Nix in this quarterback competition. He's facing off against Ty Thompson. Thompson also was solid, 168 yards and one touchdown. Got things going for him in the second quarter. Yeah, I thought Ty Thompson, here's a nice throw by Ty, although that would have been a sack defense, I see you. That was a nicely thrown ball to the sideline on the crossing route. And then this touchdown to Franklin in the back of the end zone. It's spoken like a true defensive coordinator. <laughs> and here's some plays that you'll certainly love here, Coach Allen. It's highlighted DJ Johnson in this disruptive front that applied pressure all day long, but the interceptions were also a plenty in this spring game as that tip pass is finally corralled. And then Thompson again, this time, a bit of an overthrow, and that is picked up by Triquez Bridges, and you love how quickly he took this back into the end zone. Yeah, you love when your defense goes in transition and becomes defense to offense. Nice play by him. But it was DJ Johnson, as we mentioned earlier, that allowed those DBs to play tight man-to-man -man coverage because he was in the backfield more than most of the running backs in this spring game. And that would put a end to this spring game, one that is a salute to the service members here of the Oregon National Guard. And for Dan Lanning, a lot to be excited about, but a lot to also work on as they get set for fall camp. But the Oregon Ducks, lots of things shining for them on this sunny day in late April as Team Yellow gets the 31-21 victory in the 2022 Oregon football spring game.